On December 3rd, 2008, we had a break in the, the um, I'm a school teacher. We had a break doing the um, report cards. So I was out doing something. I got out of my car and a white object came by my car very quickly. It hit my car door, which was open. I'm, I'm now standing in the street. The car door went this way and knocked me back into my car. The white object was a transit bus. After getting hit by the bus, it seemed to move something. I was off angle. I was not quite straight. And five cervical and three lumbar parts of my body, discs, whatever you want to call them, moved a little bit and created a lot of pain. Stairs were a challenge the first year. We took them slowly. That's all. It wasn't a major problem. Actually, when it got bad, I slipped down the stairs on the couch with a board for the first few months. I couldn't pick up my grandbabies. My nieces and nephews had cup one. I couldn't pick them up. It bothered me. And now I got two new ones. And now I can't. But it makes me happy I can pick them up now. My little Jack I can pick up. That's great to do. And I couldn't do that for two and a half years. I now can walk three to four miles a day without pain. And I haven't done that in years. I was never a jogger, but I always was a walker, and now I can walk long distances. In fact, my dog's lost two pounds the last year because she walks with me. And now I can even sit in a booth in a restaurant. Before, I always had to have a hard chair. Now I don't have to pick just a hard chair. The tables, I can pick the booths also. I would recommend this office and the office above because of their patience, their consideration of you being a human being first and second, and how can they help you make your life better or bring it back like me to better. And they can do it with their passion and their knowledge. And I'm, I'm key on the passion first and the knowledge second. If you don't feel comfortable in some place, doesn't matter how smart you are, you can't do it. And I feel comfortable here immediately. Thank you.